We are witnessing an active weather night across East Tennessee with the most severe weather from this round of storms coming after dark and reporter Jacinta Render does share part of her conversation about the storm threat with the National Weather Service. Weather experts say people should be on the lookout for what's coming tonight in East Tennessee. Now current thinking is that a majority of the kind of the severe storms are going to be south of Knoxville, uh, more around the kind of southeast part of Tennessee. The Loudoun County Sheriff's Department is among the first responders on standby, prepared for whatever comes. And so if you do live in one of the low-line areas, you know, ex exercise a little bit extra caution, especially the roadways in the low-line areas. Storms that hit overnight pose even more concerns and leaders at National Weather Service say day or night, we need to stay connected. There's a good thing to do is have multiple ways of getting weather information and kind of stay weather aware of what's going on. David Holt says people can use weather apps on phones or tablets, tune into their local radio and news. Plus, the National Weather Service offers updates 24-7. So, you know, definitely stay aware uh, of, your, of your surroundings. People on the move traveling during the holidays need to keep those same safety alerts in mind. So it will be a very busy evening across uh, parts of northern Georgia. Uh, down into the southern parts of Tennessee and northern Alabama. Downed trees, power outages, and downed electrical lines are all possibilities given the strength of the incoming storms. But the National Weather Service predicts most of East Tennessee should be in the clear right around 11 Wednesday night. In Knoxville, I'm Jacinta Render.